Vidium's FTW. Featuring G-Man Rocks. Oh, he was about to do the crash dance. <laughs> Shit, okay. You messed it up. Oh, my bad. Welcome to part two. Welcome um, back. Okay, so not only do we apologize for that, but I apologize for part one because the audio was really loud on the game's, uh, the game's audio. We're was, sorry. It was quite loud. So we've, uh... We're just gonna make do with what we have, though. Yeah, so that's been uploaded. Yep. Sucks, but we've had audio issues. So many audio issues in the past. Mm -hmm. Um, this one should be a little bit better. I'll listen to it back. We'll just keep tweaking the sound a little bit. Uh... Audio mixing is the best part of making a fucking video. Yep. Oh, but here's Spike. Yep. When we're first introduced to the Titan. First titty. <laughs> yeah, and just the whole concept idea of just jacking enemies and using their powers to fight other enemies seems pretty g cool and unique for Crash. Yeah. You don't really even see it in many other platformers. I wonder if I wonder if there are any other ideas like this. I'm sure, they had some ideas planned for the future. Who knows what they could have done with the reboot. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, I mean, they've got an ambush up ahead. There's yeah. Ka Uka over there. Yeah, blocks off your path. Whee! <laughs> Yeah, the game really is fun, though. Like, yeah. I enjoy it a lot. There it what, is! There we go. I think what really turned a lot of people off is just the beat-em-up gameplay and all the enemies that you have to fight in that in sections, as an example, just like this one, where Uka blocks off your path in order for you to continue through the level, is that they force you to do a lot of beat-em-up gameplay against the enemies, is that people would have preferred it if it had just a little bit more platforming, but they fixed it for the sequel, is that it had just a good, perfect blend of half beat-em-up, half platforming. Yeah. And they improved the gameplay for the Titans in Mutants as well, because in that game you could actually jump with the Titans. Yeah, and you can store them. That was yeah. cool. I don't want this one. I don't care. <laughs> it's like a good combo, and then you just yeah. Z them. Charge attack! Mm -hmm. uh, you cannot break their block. Yes, you can. It's called fucking charge attack. <laughs> Z attack, idiot. Wii version. Just I want the black one. used to the gameplay. I want the black and white one. He's mine. Yeah. <laughs> Differently colored that makes them unique. <laughs> Bam! Give me them. Give me dead ace! Yeah, they're crazy stronger and, uh, <laughs> as you go on. Because then they take more hits. Yep. Timber! Yeah! This is the end of episode one right here. Yep. Let's cut the little mojo. With the so much, yeah. Handy it's dandy. So much oh, easier. God. With the, the cursor, cursor. Yeah. <laughs> I don't I like even it. have to run into it. I can just. I love this. I love this right here. I love the fluidity. Yeah. You just beat him up. Boom. Just pick up on the, the next mojo. one. Yep. That's so fast. Yeah. Just the press of a button, and you're like immediately on the next one. Yeah. I love it. Ow. Although sometimes I notice that they actually do try to slow down the animation. Yeah, I wish like in Legend of Sparrow how it's like a choice to have slow mo. Yeah. Like slow mo chance they call it. I wish they had that in this game. It's like yeah, the one like kind. Of, that's a more of a nitpicky criticism. It's like mm -hmm. uh, not really a flaw, just a nitpick. Yeah. So there's that. Back All to right. G man. <laughs> Here you go. All right. Bada bing, bada bing, bada bing. Yeah. Hey. Hey. Gold. Hey. Boogity boogity. We did it. Episode one. Episode one. Spoik. Almost everything. <laughs> yeah. Not bad. Alright, next episode. Uh, what's it called? A uh, succumbing to age story. Yeah. Well, once we get there. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> episode 2. A succumbing to age story. Oh, Greg Eagles. <laughs> oh, Grim. How oh, I miss the sweet voice that is yours. I don't know what that means. Mm -hmm. Gore! He's very gory. I'll cut you right up. Who Get you, him! Who do you prefer? 
Mel Winkler or Greg Eagles when it comes to comparing Mel Winkler, Winkler because of the father. I'm just so used to that fatherly figure. Here he is just the very comedic mentor. The which is still father fine. milk voice. <laughs> yeah, but that fucking <laughs> soothing ass fatherly voice is just so like Children. that encompasses him. Children. I love it. But I love that Greg Eagles nailed it down. He wasn't necessarily trying to do Mel Winkler, he was just yeah. trying to do his own version of that kind of tone. Sounds similar. And it worked a lot. It yeah. definitely worked. I was very skeptical well, not skeptical, I was very anxious to hear it. Mm -hmm. So when I finally did during the warped uh we were like, oh my Stuff. god. I was freaking out. You can see it on Periscope. Yeah. I was freaking out. I love Aku's voice. I love Uka's voice. <laughs> yeah, John DiMaggio did a real good job, too, reprising his role. I like Engine's voice, but why does Engine sound like Edna Mode from Incredibles? That's what he sounds like the first <laughs> comparison I made. I'm like, he sounds so, like... You, you want to go a few rounds? <laughs> he sounds like <laughs> Edna Mode. It's hilarious. What were they thinking? <laughs> <laughs> Corey Burton. Yeah. We wanted Nolan North, man. Who knows? They might bring him back for a reboot. If it happens, I wouldn't be opposed. Yeah. Meanwhile, with the little cute foxy. <laughs> See, it's one of Crash's own kind. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, he's dead meat now? He's a f because he is a fox in jeans, after all. Yeah. <laughs> An orange dog. If that Drake fella was right, <laughs> it is only but a... Uh, fox in jeans. Fox in jeans. <laughs> but he doesn't even wear jeans Deflect in the it. original games. Deflect it! Spin! No, I got it, I got it. Spin! I got it. Spin! No, there you go, there's well, your spin. spin his attack back at him. But then you made me dizzy. <laughs> There you go, see? That's Slow. an example I was talking about. It only happens sometimes, but it's really weird. Oh, good old oh, Nathan Drake. Name. Oh, that's right. You, have, you only have the PS2 version, don't you? I have the PS2 version, Xbox 360 version, Game Boy and DS version, just not the Wii version. Every version but the one we're playing now! And the PSP version. <laughs> Everything but the version we're playing yep. now. This is my first time playing the Wii version. <laughs> That's amazing. <laughs> yeah. Hit them targets! Yeah. Go up there. Because sure this, is a, the this is a good sense of like, okay, they use the Wii remotes like it's, you know... Yeah. Not full capability, of course, but like, they integrated it pretty well. It doesn't feel very like, alright, now hit and use the Wii remote. It's like, uh, okay, whatever. Yeah. It feels pretty good, actually. It's better than nothing. Good way to, great job quoting my number nine. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh man. That poor ass game. <laughs> it's funny you pointed out that I still have it on my fucking Wii U. Yeah. I was like, we shit. Talking I never, about it earlier. Never deleted it. <laughs> After I made that video on Destination Mark, I never deleted it. Yeah. <laughs> oh man. One thing about the co-op in this game that I thought was f fucking weird is the piggyback thing. Oh yeah. Where you jump and it goes, and then like you're the other player. Yep. And then they get to control crash, or carbon crash, and then they jump, boom, and then it's you again. It's like, what the fuck? What were they thinking with that gameplay? It's fucking weird. I also liked it in Mutants how you could actually turn into a tiki mask and actually shoot. Yeah, but they look horrifying! Nah. Jesus Christ! They don't look that scary in my opinion. Uh, put it up right now. <laughs> yeah, fucking, that's in the I've game. I've seen it. <laughs> it's not that bad. Gonna put another one up, there it is. <laughs> fucking, oh. <laughs> Especially if you look at that at like two in the morning, sweet dreams, kids. <laughs> God, Jesus! Be careful, Gianni. Don't have fucking to take risks. Don't fall off. Don't fall off the platform. <laughs> don't fall off mushroom. You're going to die. Yeah. Here comes ambush. Get ready, or you can just skip. There's nothing stopping you. No, I fight. <laughs> Let me scared. bounce off his head. <laughs> I'm not scared. Hey, not no pussy care. <laughs> yeah, I met your, met your cat at yeah. the end. It's funny. Get combo king. Yeah, I'm trying. Combo king. No. Oh, they, yeah. I think you still got it. No, no, you didn't. Fuck, man, they demand so much. You have to spin it multiple times. Yeah. 
Actually, this is the first time I've seen a there spin, jump, spin, jump method. I've never done that before. I usually wait. If I can get Combo King automatically, I'll do it. But if I can't, I'll just wait till I get fucking unlimited spin. Yeah. <laughs> nice. Minion Master. Bada boom. Bada boom. Oh, almost. What? Over. Oh, because that 44 combo didn't count? Nope. It came me, you're a one off. <laughs> but even the 44 didn't count. Booga booga. Well, to the next time. Yeah, for episode three. Three! Conveniently enough, we're going to episode three. Yeah. Hey! Yeah. It's the end of the episode. Go home. Go home, everybody.